phones. WMC Action News 5. Dozens of youth detained by MPD at a local park tonight, but they say it was all a big misunderstanding. The group says they were simply trying to shoot a music video. But WMC Action News 5's Jerry Askin now reports live to tell us why police say this was far from just an expression of art. Jerry? And Joe, in the past 10 minutes or so, police told us eight people are facing charges right now at 201 Poplar, seven facing gun charges, one facing a drug charge after a video shoot involving guns at a park. These guys say it simply was a video shoot for rapper Jay Fizzle. It wasn't no harm by the video. But the issue, police say it involved guns at a park where kids usually play. We were showing the video to have fun. The video shoot landing many of them in handcuffs for hours Thursday, then placed in this large transport vehicle, all as police shut down O.L. Cash Park after neighbors complained. In all, 38 teens were detained, many of them eventually released. Yeah, you hear that music? You hear me? Video? I want gang related. But a police source told me that's not true. The source told me many of these guys detained were high-ranking gang members and some had felony warrants. Plus, we know from police, seven guns were recovered. My source told me there were drugs, too. You could have children in the, you know, in the park, and maybe one of the guns could go off, anything. Rosetta Harold watched from behind the crime scene tape as her son was in police custody. Take him to jail to give me my vehicle, that's all. She said he knows better. I've been warning him and talking with him, and he, he's not paying attention, so this didn't make him be a wake-up call for him. And again, many of these teens say it was a Jay Fizzle video shoot. Um, my attempts to reach him today failed. We're live downtown. Jerry Askin, WMC Action News 5. New tonight, investigators say robbery was the motive for last night's shooting at the Southland Mall. A police report says the shooting victim told police a man approached him in the parking lot armed with an assault rifle before robbing and shooting at him and then taking off. The victim was taken to a hospital where he was treated and released. At this point, no arrests have been made. Developing now, seven people have pleaded guilty in a Memphis federal court for distributing more than 100,000 oxycodone pills in the Mid-South. The DA says Courtney Jones Group trans